This is the beginning of a journey, but no ordinary journey, a journey back to life. The Envis of Neath was designed as a canal community boat, but for the last two years she has lain majestically amongst the broken vehicles, rusted cogwheels, brambles and weeds of a scrapyard, waiting to be rescued. Today is Tuesday the 24th of May 2011, the day of rescue. Members of the Monmouthshire, Brecon and Abergavenny Canals Trust have gathered to make the boat ready. It's a case of all hands to the pumps, or every man to his frying pan. Bailing out is not easy, but every bit of weight counts. Yep. At 10 o'clock, the crane arrives. There's a sense of nervous tension amongst everyone. Would the boat still be too heavy for the crane to lift? The crane moves in as close as it possibly can and raises its mighty arm. Straps are attached to the boat. Slowly, the crane takes the weight. Nobody wants to miss the moment the boat is raised from ground level. But it's no use. The crane needs to be repositioned to get in even closer. Time for a second lift. This time, the success is almost immediate. With incredible patience, the boat is raised and guided away from its resting place. Nobody claps or cheers, but there is a sense of relief. The crane is up to the job. However, there is no room for error. Every movement must be slow and considered, as at 20 tons, Envis is at the very limit of the crane's capabilities. The men make it look easy. It really is amazing to see something so big move so gently and expertly. From now on, everything goes smoothly. Slowly, the transporter reverses into position. Envis will soon be on her way. The next stage of her journey is to be transported to Newport, where she'll be received at the power station. Her new home is also very different from the scrapyard. She is loaded onto a conveyor and winched into her very own five-star accommodation. This shed will be her home for the next 12 months. It's an opportunity to inspect the hull and it looks like Envis is in very good condition. Greasing the rails and plenty of elbow grease are needed to take Envis into position. Finally, she comes to rest under the protective shadow of the power station. When it is finished, the community boat will be operated on a navigable section of the canal by Trust volunteers. Its function will be to raise the profile of the canal and to assist the Trust in its mission to promote and restore it. Our aim is to include the whole community who will be encouraged to take a trip on this beautiful waterway to learn about its history and wildlife. Financial help is urgently needed not only to fund the boat's restoration, but also in future to cover its ongoing running costs. All donations and offers of help to run the boat are very much welcomed. Please contact the 14 Locks Canal Centre to find out more.